Hey guys, so we're back. Um, it's about 1.30 in the morning now, and um, we're out at Jenny Dixon Beach. Molly's been here out. Molly's been here out. Molly's been out here before. Um, I've driven through here, never actually stopped to, to have a look around. So, um, well, we're just gonna see how this goes, I guess. Hopefully we're gonna be able to light some candles and stuff. And, see what we pick up, so stay tuned. Alright, so we're headed down to the beach now. Um, I'll just get Molly to quickly tell you what he was saying just before. Um, I actually just heard something just, just then, like coming from down here. Like, no, no shit, like it just sounded like it was just there. But we'll go sit on the seat and see it. I'll tell you about it. So I was having a quick seat here and Molly's just going to fill us in about some of the, the stories and the legends about the spirit. Alright, so allegedly uh, a girl in the 70s or 60s, depending on what article you want to read, uh, was raped and murdered here. Uh, once again, there's nothing, there's like no concrete evidence to say that or at least in my research that I've found to say that it actually happened but with everything that's happened it's kind of hard to separate fact from fiction um, everything's been lost over time and it's kind of hard to figure out when all this happened but apparently also in the early 90s um, a bunch of kids were camping down here at Jenny Dixon Beach and apparently there was an apparition of a white lady in a white dress arms outstretched down on the beach so who knows what we're gonna find uh, in one of my other videos that I did here I was here with John Rose unfortunately that is his real name merch coming soon <laughs> <laughs> you said that man. I did um, we got incredible like evidence at least what I consider evidence of all this. Like it was just... That was weird. All right. Yeah, we got incredible evidence of everything that, that yeah, I can't even, I can't even fucking do it. Something touched my fucking arm. I felt, I felt something just do this. I felt something just go like that, like no joke. Like there's, there's nothing here. There's nothing here. Long story short, ghost lady on the beach. We're gonna see if she's here. Apparently she's also buried at Noraville Graveyard in an unmarked grave. Yeah, right. We find the unmarked grave, we find where she is. Apparently, you can also appear standing in the water. Once again, it really just depends on who you, who you kind of ask and what might be doing. Yeah, when I was here with John last, we were over on the rocks, over yonder. Told us to go back to the parking lot. That's how intense it got. The steps get steeper. Felt like it, eh? Sorry if you guys are having a hard time hearing me right now. Sorry if you guys are having a hard time hearing me right now. We are on the beach and the waves are quite loud, so I'll do my best to try and keep audio as crisp as I can. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna see what's about.
I was here last. You know where we were standing, right? Yeah. Uh, I know it's a little bit over from that. We have to see where the light is there. Oh, yeah. Just over there. That's where me and John were. And then just above from that, above from that is where the cliff face. We heard do, do, shit do, 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 do. That is not me, hey. Right where my torch is, can you see white? Just there, up there? No, 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 down, about? down, down. Our level. Just behind that fucking rock there? Yep. Dude, it's got a fucking clear shadow. No! You guys can't fucking see this. No! Dude, I'm literally about to fucking shit. It's gone. No! No, I'm fucking... I'm fucking done, cunt. Nah. What the fuck? Dude, I'm... Oh, no. I'm like full fucking chills, man. Dude. Dude we just fucking found Jenny Dixon. <laughs> cunt. <laughs> no fucking way did we just do that. Do you know what the fuck... YouTube can't see this shit, though, because we're like... Do you want to go over a bit closer and see if we can get... It? Like this. We, we need, we need this. Alright guys, so we're going to try and run over there and see if we can get this. Dude, it's fucking gone, man. You were saying, like around here, yeah? Yeah, around like where that sign is. It was like... That seems pretty fucking fresh. Boots. I mean, look, we're lightly stepping. This is what our old guys And we're barely breaking surface. And even here, I'll show you guys. That, that barely did anything. Dude, that looks like a fucking woman's print for sure, cunt. So, me and Molly both just saw that, and we are pretty convinced that we literally did just see Jenny Dixon. Um, this has fucking thrown us right out. We are beyond skeptical on what we just witnessed. From that distance that we were just at, where you could not see, <clears throat> we saw a distinct white figure with a perfect shadow behind it which clearly looked like the figure of a woman um, it was literally just over here by that sign there <clears throat> um, I honestly don't know what to say I'm gonna see if there's fucking prints over here man Except for that fucking kicked up stand. Yeah, but no, those are crab holes. They're right next to the end of all the crab holes. Like, did we just... Like, that just happened, yeah. 
hundred percent that just happened. It wasn't just me. Like, no, we just because I spotted it, man. So it's not just you. Can't what the fuck. Dude, your torch just flickered, hey. What? Your torch is fucking flickering. Like at the fucking zombie house. It's not as bad as a zombie house, but it's going like... I... I don't know what to say. I honestly don't know what to say. I've seen shit before, like actual spirits before, but like only ever once. Apart from like, I mean, I, I, look, yeah, I've seen a few, but I don't, that was just, that was just, I do. There's fucking more prints here. There's more prints and stuff, but boot prints, fucking feet marks. Look, they're fucking everywhere, man. Jenny Dixon video thing started. I was gonna do a quick little thing here. All right, so before we get going from here, um, we're gonna, it's high tide, go to the rocks. Um, yeah, so we're gonna get going from here, sorry. And um, we're gonna head to Norville Graveyard and see if we can find that unmarked grave that Marley was talking about to see if it's actually true. So, he's hoping, hey? Pro turn on. 
Alright guys, so we're now at Norville Graveyard. <coughs> it's about two minutes to three. So Marley was saying that stuff normally happens at about three. So we're about to go in. Marley's just fixing up his GoPro real quick. Um, yeah. We're expecting some pretty weird shit. Hopefully we can find this um this unmarked grave that'll give us more of a hint on what actually happened tonight and what we actually saw which would be nice so and would give us like a clear thought pattern of what we actually saw and give us what would you, what would you say to give us like a bit of closure bit of closure yeah that's the word I'm after all right so we're heading in now guys so Let's, let's get this going. We're here at Norville Graveyard, and it is... Look at that, guys. Let's see if you guys can see this. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. The witching hour. Are we fucking stupid? Maybe. But I, I suggest we walk on the road, I'll tell you why in a moment. Being here at three in the morning, but it's this is gonna be this is gonna get real. This is gonna get real very quick. Let's get started, guys. <coughs> well, I just want to add as well. Marley has been here before, and some weird shit did go down. So yeah, we are expecting the worst to happen if anything is to happen. So. If anything does, you guys are going to see it first. Um, just a quick heads up. Right as you were saying oh, I, that you've never been here before, lightning strike. What? We have fucking lightning strike? It was just over there. It wasn't any, it was a lightning strike. Like, as soon as you step foot into here, you'll feel. Like, you can already feel it. Ready? How different yeah. is that just to then be over there? The air just feels more dense. So fresh. So how far does this stretch, man? What a fucking tripping. I'll put my thing on low beam. Alright, so this thing, pretty much, if there's any cars that come, we're just going to turn our lights down a bit, because they might think we're being super sus. But, it smells a bit different too. Huh? Smell it. Dude, it smells so different than it did just before. Where car tracks are beat, we are fine.
looks pretty old, man. I'm gonna say if it's anyone, it's gonna be that one. My thing just went from not I went from one to nine. Like I thought it stopped recording and started again because it was all zeros. There's one thing that I need to do again. Sit down right here. Bust this out. screen record as well. So guys, it looked like we did just find an unmarked grave. Um, we're not sure if it could be the one we are looking for, if it is here. But as you said, there she is buried here in an unmarked grave. So, who's to say that that's not it. I mean, it looks old. This happened in what, like the 60s, 70s? Mm. So, the surrounding area of it and the concrete of it looks to be quite old. So, there's not much more we can really say. If that is the grave, then what happened tonight? could quite possibly be well, what we think it could be. Who knows, like... I'm just still beside myself, man. Well, hopefully this app is going to do something for us then. Got this on screen record, so you guys will be seeing everything. But... Is there anyone here that is willing to speak to us? Is there anybody here willing to speak with us? I don't need screen record on anymore. Please tell me you just heard that. Yeah, I did. That's why I'm looking, man. That was behind us. I just looked behind us. That's why I was looking behind us the first time. Is there anyone here willing to communicate with us? Use the device sitting in front of me. Use all your power. Dude. Where are you looking? 
straight through there. Uh huh. That's where I've seen shit before. That's where I've seen stuff, man. See how there's a bunch of trees and then there's three in like a straight line? Mm hmm. Straight through the middle there. Mm hmm. I was saying something fucking swaying, man. Yep. And it's still going. You guys can't see this, unfortunately. Who are you apologising to? Who or what are you apologising to? We want to help you move on. So guys, I just came up saying sorry. We want to help you, we don't mean you any harm. We are sorry if we are disturbing you, but we don't mean you any harm. If you wish to continue... Dude, can you feel that breeze? Dude, it's just like 10 minutes up. Betty. Was Betty a loved one of yours? Betty was perhaps your soulmate. If you are apologizing to her, I can guarantee I can guarantee you that she forgives you. I guarantee you that she forgives you. Is there anything else you wish to say? I just fucking feel something touch my leg. Oh, I keep, I keep feeling something around my neck, man. It's like something. Learn. Can you... Are you saying learn from your experiences? Uh, we aren't quite understanding what you mean by learn. Should we not be here, perhaps? That I haven't learnt my lesson here. Would you like us to leave you alone? Just felt something touch my leg, dude. Like on the underside of my leg. Would you like would you like us to leave you alone? Would you like us to leave? If there's, if this is the person that was saying sorry to Betty, would you like us to leave? So am I, and to me it sounded fucking behind us. Yeah. Did you hear that? 
Yeah, there's a car driving by. Take it to do. To do. Would you like me to leave us? Would you like... Would you like for me and Cameron to leave you alone now? Something touched my arm. Dude. Whatever it is, it smells rank. That is a bad sign. That's a bad sign. Smell. What did you mean by smell? It smells bad here. Would you like us to leave? Right here, dude. Right here. Yeah, Difficult. Are you finding it difficult to talk to us? Dude, something's touching my shoulder right now. My fucking left shoulder, right fucking now. Nothing's there, dude. Nothing's there. I swear to God, my fucking shoulder is getting heavier. We, we gotta go, dude. We gotta go. This is bad. Goodbye. Goodbye. We do not wish to speak to you anymore. Goodbye. Like, literally, this is what it felt like, man. Nah, dude. Dude. Like, it literally felt like someone was about to just go. Dude, I, I felt this. I felt this. And I also felt this. Ready? Stop, I felt this. I am not fucking leaving your place without you fucking saging the fuck out of me, man. No, I don't plan. I, I plan on saging you, dude. Don't. Don't worry about that. Guys, smell. It's it smells of rank. Guys, so we're getting the fuck out of here. Just not, standing there then. This is not good. Um I literally felt my shoulder getting heavier and heavier as if someone was literally just about to push me. So that's not a good sign in my books. That's not a good sign in Marley's books. So we're just gonna leave um this place. Before we leave. Before we leave. You have to stand here. And I'm going to say a few words. Whoever we came into contact with tonight, we sincerely apologize. We do not mean to disturb you. We merely wanted to make your presence known. And you have done so and we thank you gratefully. However, we are not meant to be here. So we apologize. We are sorry for disturbing you. We wish you nothing but peace and hope that you can find your way along. May you rest in peace. May you rest in peace. Goodbye. Goodbye. But yeah, guys, as I was saying, I can't see anything. Um, this is insane. Okay, yeah, but like I was saying, I literally felt my left shoulder getting weighed down as if someone was just about to push me. And it was the most uncomfortable feeling I have ever had 
in my entire life. I was literally stopped in my tracks. I did not know what to do other than to just stand still. So, so yeah, I just stood still. I did not like that at all. It made me feel highly uncomfortable. But yeah, we're getting out of here. This will probably be the end of this video. So guys, don't forget to like the video. Comment on the video if you want. Leave us some ideas on what we can do. Share the video with your friends if you enjoyed it. Hopefully they'll like it too. Hit that subscribe button, it helps me out. Go check out Marley's channel, check him out, share him with your friends, comment on his videos, like his videos as well, subscribe to him if you want. Hit both our post notification bells because then you'll know when we both upload. And guys, thanks for sticking around. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. All right, guys, so I am going to end this video here. A lot of weird and crazy things happened off camera that you guys missed as well but again a lot of weird shit happened tonight um, we are still confused and puzzled about what actually happened tonight um, we can't explain any of it so we're gonna try and do a bit more research on what actually happened so apart from that <clears throat> guys hit that subscribe button smash that like button as well whilst you're there comment on these videos if you are enjoying them but whilst you're down there as well hit that post notification bell because that way you guys will be notified whenever I post so you can keep up to date with all my videos guys thanks for watching this video love you all peace